emotions in the world to bring you on today's on out. And now, here's the shout at who puts the fun in fun house. It's J.D. Ross. Oh, oh, she's going to get it later. She's going to get it later. All right, everyone, how you doing? Today is Seven Seas Day on Fun House. We're going to get wet. We're going to get wild. We're going to have a lot of fun, so stay with us. But first, let's bring out today's players and the cheerleaders, Jackie and Sam. Now, today is Seven Seas Day, so I'm going to ask everyone the same question. What's your favorite animal under the sea? Dolphin. Oh, I like dolphins. What about you, Chris? Octopus. Uh, she said octopus. <laughs> Let's hear for the red team. What's up, Brian? Favorite animal? Chambered Nautilus. A what? Chambered Nautilus. <laughs> what is that? Um, it's, rel it's related to the octopus, and its head is like a squid's head. This guy's an encyclopedia on fish. <laughs> It's unbelievable. Chris, how you doing? Good. Favorite animal under the sea? A seal. A seal? A seal. All right, let's hear it for the gold team. <laughs> my, my favorite animal is the mermaid, and her name is Star. It's a great mermaid. <laughs> Are you guys ready to play the game? Yeah. You want to get messy? Yeah. Let's get messy. messy. Guys, you coming with me? Let's yeah. go, boys. Come on. Yeah. Everyone's coming in here. We are under the sea on the ocean floor for this stunt. We call it crab soccer because you got to play soccer just like crabs do. Take a look at this guy's hat. Look at that thing. That means they're going to have to crawl on their hands and feet just like crabs do, like this. Check this out, fellas. All right, you're going to be kicking the ball just like that, all right? Here's how it works. We've got 11 balls in the middle of our ocean floor soccer field. The guy's job is to kick as many of those balls into their opponent's goal as they can in 30 seconds. While they're kicking, they're not going to forget to block their opponent's shots. You see, guys, this isn't going to be as easy as it sounds. Some parts of the ocean floor are really slimy. As a matter of fact, all parts of the ocean floor are really slimy. And our soccer field is the slimiest out of everything. You guys ready? Yeah. All right, let's do like crabs do. Let's get going. Set the clock. Go ahead. You guys are going to slip and be careful. All right. They're getting in position. Audience, let me hear some noise. On your mark. Get set. Go. See, careful. As you can see, the gold team got one ball in their goal. The red team didn't get any in there. That's okay. Gold team, you have fun? Yeah. This is a messy stunt. We're going to go back and award the points. Guys, you stay here, all right? All right. You know, that's a lot harder than it looks. You don't understand. But the gold team gets the 25 points for kicking one in the goal. All right, girls, listen up. Your teammates just became Funhouse Soccer Crabs. Which of the following is a real kind of crab? A badminton crab, a horseshoe crab, or a croquet ca crab? A horseshoe crab? That's right, for 20 points. Way to go. I think she's a little bit excited. That gives the gold team 50 points. The red team can still come back. There's a lot of game left. All right, when we come back, we're going to be in the pool for some underwater dolphin diving. This is hot. we got underwater cameras and everything. Stay with us. picked up this next stunt from our good old mammal friends, the dolphins. It's called dolphin diving, and teams, guess what? They're the dolphins. Here's how it works. We're going to throw these colored rings into the pool. Now, guys, just like trained dolphins, their job is to dive underwater, put the dolphin nose right through the ring like that. Then they're going to pass it from their nose to their partner's nose without using their hands. Very good demonstration. I'm impressed. They're going to dive for another ring. Keep going on like that. The girl dolphin with the most rings on her nose after 45 seconds is going to win the stunt. All right, you ready? Let's, let's throw in these rings, all right? Let's set the clock. 
All right, get in position. Go for it. On your mark. Get set. Go. All right, it's time to rock and roll. Just like dolphins. Perfect. Perfect, just like dolphins. You gotta get those rings around your nose. It's not easy at all. Let's see how they're doing. Come on. We're gonna find out, keep them on your nose now. We're gonna find out how well the red team did. We got one, two, three, four. Now we're going over the gold team. The gold team got one, two, red team wins the stunt, they're on the board. Good high five, oh yeah. We're going back to award the points, let's go, come on. Careful, it's slippery. All right, we're running back in here. Everyone's coming in. The red team did a good job. They're on the board now at 25 points. Good work. We're going to our questions for the girls. Girls, hands on buzzers. Now, your teammates just made terrific dolphins. Now, you know dolphins are mammals, right? Which of these sea creatures is also considered a mammal? The whale? Chris. A whale. That's right, for 25 points. She got right in there. The gold team's got 75. Red team's got 25. We're going to our next stunt, girls. You pumped? Yeah. Let's do it, Dan. Come on, girls. Oh, my goodness. Look at this guy. Well, you know, I'm about to do this great stunt. I could use your help. What's up? I can't, J.D. Why not, Tiny? What's wrong? A shark ate my shark. What? The shark came by and ate my shark, my hat, my sunglasses, and my book. And I can't go anywhere without him. All right, Tiny, look, don't worry. Don't be a crybaby, please, Tiny. Relax. I'm getting all upset about this. All right, I'm going to go over and see if I can work this out, okay? Okay. All right. All right. All right, let's go over here. Now, girls, I just caught these two killer sharks, and I think they ate Tiny's stuff. The girl's job is to reach right into the shark's mouth and pull out Tiny's hat, shorts, sunglasses, and his book. As soon as they find something, they're going to bring it right over to their team cube right here and then go back for more. But, you know, sharks eat anything. They're going to find lots of other slimy, disgusting stuff in there. First player to find all four of Tiny's things within a minute is going to win. Let's set the clock. All right, the girls in the position. I'm going to straighten out our buddies here. We've got to get their best angle. On your mark. Let's hear it, audience. Get set. Go. It's got some kind of shark goo all over it. We've got Tiny's hat. Tiny's sunglasses have seen much better days. And we have Tiny's shorts. This is disgusting. I, don't, I better wash this for him before I get back. He might cry. Red team, you have a good time anyway? Yeah. All right, we're going back to award the points. Let's get busy. <laughs> for winning that stunt, we're going to give the excitable gold team 25 points. We're going to our question for the guys. Listen up, boys. After eating tiny stuff, those sharks could use a real good toothbrushing. As part of cavity prevention, which of the following is a toothbrush supposed to remove from teeth? Plaque, enamel, or fluoride? Go for it, Chris. Plaque. Plaque is right for 25 points. They needed that. At the end of the stunt run, because the red team's 50, the gold team's got 100. Coming up, it's time for the Funhouse Grand Prix race. That's the event that's going to lead one of our teams to the incredible new Funhouse. We're having a great time. Grab something to eat. Don't go anywhere. We're going to the starting line. Let's go. Come on.
at the first stop. They're going to pick up three of the octopuses out of their inky bed and put them into the sub. Then they're going to race to the bed of seaweed, grab an armload of kelp, and dump it in with their teammates. On the second lap, we're going to switch lanes and jobs. They're not going to forget to grab the tokens. Guys, at the first stop, pick up a handful of jewels at the treasure chest, put them on your teammate in the sub. Then at the last stop, they're going to pick up one of our beautiful, gorgeous mermaids from today's studio audience and set her on board the sub with their teammates. First team across the finish line is going to get 25 points. You ready? Yeah! All right, let's rock and roll. On your mark, jet set, go! All right, they're off. just made it across. Look at all this stuff, man. This is disgusting. It was a fun race. They win. When we come back, we're going to find out who is going to the incredible fun house. The audience is going to join us. I'm going to get everything organized. Don't go away. Now, who's heading to the incredible fun house? First, right away, we know it's 7 C's day, and they won the race. They get 25 points. That puts them up to 125. We're going to go to the gold red team's tokens first. Here we go. The white. One, two, Three, four, five, and six. We're going to the blues. One, two, three, four. That gives the red team 210 points. Way to go. That's right. We're going to the gold tokens right now. We're going to the white. One, two, three, four, five. I dropped one more and put that one in for six. All right, that gives them 185. We're going to the blues. We put one in right away. They tie up with 210. Gold team, you have three more blues. We're going to the fun house. Oh, my goodness. I think I lost my hearing. The red team played a great game. It was tough. You guys have fun? We did. All contestants receive British Knights. Get off on the right foot. Get off in BK. British Knights athletic footwear. For guys, gals, and kids, too. British Knights, the right move for you. And when the back-to-school bell rings, he's the best-dressed kid in your class in your new Gatana wardrobe. Go back to school in style. We're also giving them the home game of the fun house. It's a lot of fun. I've got one myself. Let's hear it for the Red Team. Give it up for them. Come on. All right. Thanks a lot, guys. High five for I. Yes, high five Chris. They are dying to get to the fun house for a lot of cash, a lot of prize, but mostly a lot of fun. Audience, let's get ready. Come on. Let's go to the fun house. Come on, let's go. This is it. This is their chance to run through the funhouse for a ton of cash and prizes. But first, let's show them exactly what's in the funhouse. Take it away, Timester. Rush into the funhouse. Take a spin on the terrible turntable. Then crash through the brick wall. Hidden in the fall is tag for the Konica EFB3. It's a great little camera for anyone entering the 
exciting world of 35 millimeter photography. It includes a focus free system, built on electronic flash, and oversized viewfinder for easy composition, plus color print film from Konica. Then race up to the vinyl. We're hidden in one of these leads is a tag for Platonic portable AM FM stereo radio cassette recorder. Features auto reverse and 30 watts of music power. Oh, from Lexonic. Then come see me in the cookie spot. Turn the hands to 12 midnight and I'll pop out with a tag for this GMI's lightning fast roller hockey game table. Super quick surface that's flat, zip, lock and attack. Test your reflexes. Exciting and convenient from GMI. Three steps to the soda can and grab cash. Then tumble down the white water slide to the pool. Oh! You could cross over the moon bridge, scramble underneath the aggravation falls for cash in the cave, then fall into the prize pit. And grab the tag to win, Ebonite Gyro 1 Urethane, and max them four bowling balls and accessories. The race is easy and rolls true. Now the youngest bowlers can get performance from Ebonite. Next head for the end of the rainbow. Then up into the treehouse. Hidden in the leaves is a tag for Franklin Language Master, the world's only electronic dictionary, thesaurus, and spelling corrector. All words by Merriam Webster from Franklin. Personal electronic reference. Finally, climb aboard the pirate ship and spin the ship's wheel to win a music shopping spree. You'll go wild when we take you loose from the music store of your choice for a shopping spree for all your favorite cassette tapes. All these prizes, plus the cash tags in the ship cabin, on the one of the strong in the telephony room, and on the earthquake bridge. All in today, one. Oh, yeah, it is showtime. Who's going first? I am. Listen up, Chris. When I say go, tear into the funhouse, grab any three tags you want. Come on out here, high five, big bribe, and he's going in there for three more tags. They're going to keep going on like that for two minutes. When the timer's up, oh, well, you're going to keep going for two minutes. Don't forget today's secret power prize tag. If one of them picks a secret power prize tag, the two of them are going on this great vacation tiny. You'll be going to Florida, and you'll be staying at the Sedesta Village Hotel Orlando with our family's great town of Shia Villas that are 97 secluded lakefront acres with access to water sports and only 10 minutes from Disney World. And we'll be flying you and a parent from Los Angeles to Florida on Delta Airlines. You receive the complete fantastic fly membership package with games, puzzles, and prizes from Delta. I want you guys to get that trip bad, so get in there, okay? Let's set the timer for two. I'm going to activate the funhouse. Get this thing started and go. All right, come on up here. Audio, wait, 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 wait a minute. She's so anxious to get in here. Wait a second. Come here, give me your hand. Come here. Oh. She's too excited. Come on up here. Now wait till I say go. Audience, we're going to the funhouse. Ready? Get set. Go. Left. She's got 15 seconds left. She's pretty free. 
where the pallet flies was. You know the soda can all the way at the top of the slide? That's where it was. You guys know that? The soda can all the way at the top was it. You were up there, but that's all right. You still did good. They both get the music shopping spree. Each of them getting the 35 millimeter camera. They're both getting the cassette recorder. They're also getting a hockey table. You guys like that? Yeah! You're also going to have a lot of cash to spend. How much? $300. For each of you. Yeah! All right, check their faces out. This is disgusting. A grand total, $1,846. The games, the craziness, and the surprises all continue on Fun Out with your host, me, J.D. Roth, weekdays at 5. Now stay tuned for my pal, Punky Brewster, next here on TV 38.